All right, so Hi. I'm in charge of the cream okay. cheese frosting. Yeah. So we have one stick. Two sticks. One stick of butter. <laughs> one stick of cream cheese. I'm and two cheese. cups of powdered sugar. You might need another cup, but first we're going to go in and start. So the first thing we do is we put the butter Ooh. in here. It's raining here, though. <laughs> we're going to go ahead and mush this up. Now, if you have a hand mixer, you can do it by hand. But. So then we're going to open the whole the, cream cheese. It has an electric mixer. You. Yeah, if you have an electric mixer, you should and use it. But it's really hard to do it. So then we're going to put the whole... <laughs> this is the hard part. That's the one thing. And the cream cheese is really good. Yeah, so then you put all of this in here. And we want Huggy Wicked. Okay, and all you do is sit here for like five or ten minutes and we'll just continue just to mix this up. So I'll be right back as soon as we put the powdered sugar in. Okay, so this is much niftier than trying to do it by totally hand. A lot of times I just use a fork. So you can see this is nice and creamy now. So now we're going to add a little bit of the powdered sugar in there. And we're just going to start to hey, mix. Hey, it's already raining. Nice. Mix that up. No, it's already raining though. Okay, so you just want to keep mixing. You're going to build some strong arms. Now, it, it is easier if you stand up to mix this because your whole body weight is trying to do it. But that's okay. We're going to do it the hard way today. So you just continue just to mix. So that looks pretty good right here. Well, not the dog, but this. <laughs> and then <laughs> we'll go ahead and pour the rest in there. All right, so I'll see you in just a minute. All right, so we're gonna add another half cup of powdered sugar. So that's what I'm saying. You just kind of have to keep mixing and see what thickness you like. And the good thing is, to me, powdered sugar is really sweet. But if you have all the other ingredients, it mellows the mellows it out. So we're gonna keep mixing. So the forecast said it wasn't supposed to rain. <laughs> it was a little wrong. Okay, so I need to... Okay, so instead of vanilla extract, a lot of people use vanilla extract, we're going to use lemon. You could also shred lemon on there as well, but we're just going to use the juice. So just squeeze as much as you can out there. It's always concerning when you see lightning in the skies and you have metal bowls outside. And it will bad. Okay, so go ahead and... But the reason why you need that hit. Because Look what? up and see how creamy this looks. Okay, so see, compared to in the beginning, it's nice and creamy. You don't want clumps. I mean, I've had clumps before when I couldn't get rid of them. But, okay, so now, in just a second, we need a little taste tester. So I have to say, out of any of the equipment, if you, hold on, if you don't have a blender, Use like the potato masher. Let him try. Okay, so we'll let him try this. Mm, good. Good. All right, we'll see you in a little while. All right, so what we're gonna do on the on the bottom, we're gonna put just a little glue, is what you could call it. A little glue just to hold it together. Glue? We don't need a lot there. Okay, glue is not good. Yeah, but it's it acts like glue. Sticks it together. You can't even take so it. So it doesn't fall off. Okay, so now we're gonna take our nifty um spatula. <laughs> Spreader. Spreader. We don't know what it's called. And we're gonna spread it all the way around. And look how beautiful. It already looks beautiful. Could almost be a really pretty snow cake in the winter. Auto! I feel like I could eat it. Okay, so we're just going to go all the way around. It's going to get a little messy don't, don't at times. Don't worry. You can wipe your hand, but all we look. Okay, so after we're going to spin it just a little bit. It's going to help, and it's going to be yummy. Yummy in the tummy. Yum, yum in the tummy. 
Okay, so basically I put it on the top a little bit and then I kind of pull it down and spin it. So now I have to use this because we're getting towards the end. So on the top and then nicely down. Yeah. That way it comes out nice. Don't eat, don't look at it because it, you might get hungry. Stefan obviously is very hungry in this moment. <laughs> okay, so we just keep are spinning. Are you hungry when I eat cake? Okay, we're going to take some more. Really not looking. But. You know, I have to say we were going to eat this outside. It was going to be really nice and but, cool. But I think we'll have to opt for indoors today. But, and it was why did he pour? Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and just finish this up. And I'll see you in just a second. 